What's up, Internet, and welcome to what might possibly be the final episode of uh, of Kingdom Hearts. I have no idea if it will be or not. Um, we have one world left. I don't know how long it'll take is the only thing. So, in terms of if this will be the last episode, well, I guess you'll know because I'll probably, if it is the final episode, title it like finale or something to really get the point across. Because this is, I, I've said this so many times at this point, but I'm pretty sure this is the final gummy ship section. So we're already starting off on that theme of finality. Which is going to, I guess, be plaguing this episode. Um, oh boy. Look how menacing this is. But yeah, so obviously, we can reflect, I guess, in this gummy ship section particularly. And if I was to reflect, I would say I've enjoyed this series a lot. Um, I was a bit hesitant because it's my first non-Pokemon series. And I very, really, really, really enjoyed it. Just sitting here chatting um, with you guys. Obviously, you know, bit of a weird... It's, it's, I mean, this is, I guess that's the whole YouTube conundrum is it's a bit weird. I'm just sitting here chatting myself, really. But I've really enjoyed it. Um, and I hope you guys have too. Uh, if, you've watched, if you've watched this, if you watched this all the way through, if you've watched this entire series, more power to you. <laughs> Props. Even I probably couldn't manage that. But um, I've, I've enjoyed this. I've, I've had a really good time. The Kingdom Hearts is obviously one of my favorite games. Um, and so getting to play it all. I was reflecting on um, what we're going to do with this series, in particular, I mean, in the Kingdom Hearts franchise moving forward. Whether or not I'm going to cover all the games, I don't think I'm going to end up, I mean, maybe one day, down the line, I'll cover every single game. But for instance, I can't imagine I'm going to go out of my way to cover Recoded in 358 over two days. Oops. Sorry, I just, I can feel that my mic is a bit too close to me, and so it's a bit awkward. But okay. Also, new trim, if you guys didn't notice pretty fresh looking trim it's because um oh my god i might actually die in this gummy ship section oh no that's not good at all health please please someone give me some health is it the green that restores health green generally restores health yeah there we go okay well it's not health i'm sorry it's armor of course how stupid of me but uh, i don't think i'm gonna it, uh, at least not in the near future ever cover through photo over two days or recoded because that's just not particularly fun. Um, I might end. I mean, Ch Chain of Memories is a maybe. I think I probably will cover Chain of Memories. Um, I'm definitely going to cover. Um, here we are. Here we are. End of the world. I'm definitely going to cover two, three, and Ch Birth by Sleep 100%. Andrew Drop Distance. Yeah, is that probably the best position for this to be in? I'll say it is. Um, we will happily save right here. Also, just uh, to be, I guess, on the safe side moving forward so that I don't forget it all. Ooh, we, we, we have another equipment. Raises max HP, strength, and defense. Okay, that's really good. Um, slightly raises max HP and MP. Do we want this? To, or do we want reduces I, fire, ice, lightning, and... Uh, Significantly raises defense. I think this may be... Wait, what was our options? Yeah. I think Fiagra Ring might be our best. Because we're going to be facing off against a fire guy soon. And so I'd rather be, I guess, safe than sorry. But this does mean that we have quite a lot of... Yeah, critical plus I'll happily take. And I guess in terms of the other one... After aerial combo, select follow-up attack at right time to unleash Ragnarok. Mm, we just we just don't have enough MP. Things my HP is never gonna really be critically low, so I guess Ragnarok is better than Berserk. Okay, and then let's uh, save. So obviously we are in now the end of the world, which is definitely a menacing name. Oh my god, look at this place. This is I guess it's a conglomerate to to it's a collection of worlds essentially. Created by the destruction of a bunch of other worlds, which I definitely didn't come up with off the top of my head. It is I'm reading it off the IGN walkthrough. Those worlds will be restored if we beat Ansem, right? You betcha! But if we do beat him, 
Yo, yeah. See, I quite like this personal conflict. This is a heartless world, so maybe it'll just disappear. Huh? But no worries. Even if this place goes wrong, mm. our hearts ain't going nowhere. You tell them, Goof. Sure we'll the Goofster. The Goofatron. No, but we will. <laughs> the Goof Maestro. Yeah, you're right. Okay, right. Oh, God, I'm... I promise. Scared. Right, so we need to head towards. Oh God! Uh, yeah. So there's going to be a few battles in here against. Uh, well, difficult. Um, heartless. Needless to say, yeah. So we might we might die a couple times. Come on, come on. And I'm probably going to be concentrating a lot. Okay. Right, where are you? Hi there. Thank you, Donald. Appreciate it. Appreciate it, my B. Okay, where... Whoa. Do you ever just want to stay in place? Is that genuinely too much to ask? Okay. All these are going to be like, I guess in a way, minor boss fights because they're just quite tricky. Okay, right. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Yeah, okay, you're almost... You're almost gone. So the reason why is because I know the final fight in this game, the final boss fight in this game is long. Which is, I guess, the reason why I'm not entirely sure whether or not we're going to finish the game in this episode. Because I'm not entirely sure how long this world is, per se. I'll keep an eye on the clock. If there's a chance this episode might end up being like... This episode could be anywhere from like 40 minutes to 50 minutes to bloody an hour. I'm not entirely sure. Where am I supposed to be going? <laughs> okay. Right, where are we? We're here. Okay, so let's open this. Yep, power up. Cool. What's a power up? Don't actually know what that is. Huh. Power up raises strength by one. Well, we might as well. Yeah, I'll happily take that. Oh, that's awesome. I love that. Oh, hello, Dark Balls. The Dark Balls aren't the worst thing in the world, so I mean, I guess I'll take fighting them. It's better than fighting more of those. Oh, hi, Angel Wink. Angel Boys. What's up? I was literally just about to say that I wouldn't want to fight you guys, and then you guys show up, like, on time and everything. Okay. Where are you? There you are. Are Doll and Goofy going to die to these random heartless? Well, not random. Obviously, these guys are, like, the big boys. They're the hardest bo um, bosses in the... They're the hardest heartless in the game. But at the same time, Doll and Goofy, they are still heartless. You know, I'd expect a, a little better, I guess. Okay, where are they? That, there they are. Okay. We're getting there. We're getting there. We're slowly chipping away at them, at the very least. Okay. Yep, yeah, you're almost gone too. Yeah, there we go. Okay. Almost, almost. Perfect. Perfect. Okay, we can try and restore some health, at the very least. Okay. Good. Okay. Thing is, how much do I need all the treasure? Oh, but I mean, we did get a defensive out of that. So you can't say, you know, we didn't. Wait, where are we? Okay, we're here, so we need to go over here. Okay. And then we go over... Here. Might as well open this. It's definitely going to have a fight in it, yeah. But, I mean, I'll take it. It looks... It looks... Oh, boy, it has a genuinely massive behemoth in it. Of course it does. Hi, behemoth. What's up? Yeah, that's how pathetic this guy is. He's a, just a random fight now. Okay, this is going to take a while because he takes... Ah, oh, but his defense is, I guess, a bit pitiful. 
that's good. And he's also really weak to, to gravity. So we might as well just start graviting. Gravitating? Gravitying? Not entirely sure. Hello. What's up, Horn? Horner? The horny. The horno. I'm just saying random words and hoping that something funny comes out. What's funny? I just watched um, some Bo Burnham What's Funny after before this. I, I like Bo Burnham quite a lot. Um, I think I've talked about Bo Burnham on this channel. In terms of, I think I've talked about his comedy specials. In the last, maybe the last episode as well. God, I am like a, I do just repeat the same thing over and over. But um, for me, I think Bo Burnham has, you know, that, that, that appeal of just being quite funny. and But at the same time being like, feels like anyone could write his jokes. Not that they're like bad. Not in any way. That's not, that's not at all what I mean. It's the Don Hertzfield effect. Of um, he made the short the film um, It's Such a Beautiful Day and World of Tomorrow, both of which are phenomenal. Um, but they both have the the um, aura of anyone could have made them because they're so in some ways so simplistic. Um, especially like um, it's Such a Beautiful Day. Like if you were to watch it, it has the it has a really unique writing style, but the animation is like. I guess basic and you know it's pretty basic stuff all things considered in terms of of the quality and whatnot and the art style so it's a bit so it's, it's weird okay he's almost down there we go okay cheers behemoth let's uh heal up please get a ton of money that we'll never get to spend oh well whatevs what the haps okay Oh, we got another Omega Arts. What if we just equip that? Yeah, there's no reason, I guess, not to just equip that. Our strength is gone as all we're now at 37, which is pretty cool. Okay, well, let us just continue going. I don't think we're going to open any more treasure chests from here on. Oh, but we're definitely just going to... Ah! Look at the speed we're traversing with. Oh, these are new. The uh, angel things. I don't know what their name is officially. Yeah, right, just because I'd, I'd like to be safe more than anything else. Bro, where are Donald and Goofy and what exactly are they up to? Okay, there they are. Okay. This guy doesn't seem too particularly tough. Just launching, like, you know, classic projectiles at us. They're... Okay. Oh, there's a treasure thing. There's a treasure thing. There's a treasure thing I want. The... Nah. Then we'll get the treasure thing. That's disappointing. I don't get the point of them then, because it doesn't seem like we have a chance to actually open them. Thank you, Donald. Appreciate it. Appreciate it, bro. Cheers for the for the aid. God, there is a lot of these guys doing a lot of things. Okay. You can stop being invincible any second now. There is so much going on on screen. It's fine. Okay, right, there we go. At least we're getting some, I guess, tech experience out of parrying these guys' attacks. That's always a plus. Okay. I'm so sorry if you guys just hear the sound of smack, 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 smack on the, on the controller. Okay. Right. There we go. I'm not going to lie. I'm not the biggest fan of this, this world right now. I don't remember it at all, really, because I've only ever been in it once before. Um, because, needless to say, it being the final world doesn't lend itself well to me starting up a brand new playthrough every so often. Bro, there's still so many of these things left. Oh my god. And so I can't say, you know, I'm not sorry, the biggest fan of just, I don't know, gauntlets never really appealed to me. As someone who isn't the biggest fan of combat in games generally, and um, I never really like big gauntlets of things, just for the sake of having a gauntlet of things, especially stuff with something like this, where... I don't know, especially where they're not really difficult, they're just kind of time consuming. Feels like it's just like dragging us to the final um you know, to the final fight. Okay, there we go. Cool. Again we can't actually open that, so it feels a bit useless that it's there. Oh well. Right. Um We're going this way. Wait, okay. So I assume we're going over here. 
I think we're almost at the end of this first section. I'm assuming that's another behemoth fight, in which case I don't really want to do it. So I'll just kind of... I'm assuming we're going to get stopped any second now. Any second now. I assume... No? Oh, are we actually going to... Make it to the next place? Oh, no, it seems like there's one more. One more. Okay, that makes sense. That's fine. I wonder if it's Behemoth fight. It is. Hi, what's up, Behemoth? I guess we'll find you again. Um, boy, we're finding a lot of behemoths here. Uh, we'll use a gravity, because it seems like that's the quickest way to bring his. Okay. I guess you just really don't want to be attacked. That's fine, Behemoth. Pop off, mate. Pop off. Okay. I wanted to heal, but okay. That's fine. <laughs> when Farrell and through his HP bar, though, which is good. I mean, hopefully this just gives us another Omega Art. Um, though I don't, know if the, I don't know if we'd actually benefit particularly from that. I guess we benefit for the final battle, but, to, like, but you know, the next fight, the next big boss fight that isn't just Behemoth again, is against um, someone who is uses fire a lot, and so it is another. It's a Disney villain fight as well. Who is it going to be? Ooh, is it is it Clayton two? Yes, it's just, it's just Clayton one more time. Just in case you guys just really missed Clayton. Okay. He's almost... Behemoth is almost down. To fair, in some ways this is almost uh, ideal of a fight. Just something that's not particularly difficult. And it's just kind of like... You know... Long, I guess. Thanks, Donald. For the for the assist. Get it? Because A is also the, the first letter of the word arrow. Which is the spell we've used the most in this game. Oh! No, the spell we've used the most in this game is Cure. But I actually wonder what the statistics are for that. Yeah, where is this guy? Why am I actually, like, actually losing to this guy? Well, not losing, but, like, why am I taking so much damage? I feel like I should have killed him a while ago. He's just got a lot. He's, you know, he's... It's fair. Okay, you're right. You're almost, he's almost at his end. Almost at his final point. We can uh, try and... Okay, one, and there we go. Perfect, okay. Didn't even get a level up. What is the point of you, Behemoth? What is the point of you? What is the point of you, indeed? But there we go, okay. Cool, cool, cool. Love that. Love that a lot. <laughs> oh, where are we? Okay. Jump down. Jump into the weird hall of light. I wonder where that Ansem fella went. Okay. So we've just got to essentially jump down. Yeah, there we go. Into That was a really quick jump. Wow. The giant crevice. Crevasse, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to, to, to feed you. <laughs> crevasse. I'm going to name my kid Crevasse. Okay. But here we are in the World Terminus, which um, is all about worlds. Inside every pillar, you can enter the worlds of the game to fight for good XP items. Yo, look at all this. That's okay, you, otherwise you'll enter it. Um, where are we going to go? This is, this is scary. I'm not entirely sure. I wonder where this takes us. Oh, did it just take us back? Okay, that's fine. Well, we'll go in the blue then. Okay, right, let's, let's make our way to wherever. Oh, boy. Right, well, I guess we can just keep proceeding. It seems. I don't think there's anything particularly stopping us. So you might as well. Wait. Oh, can we not just skip this one? Is there... Is there... Aw, oh, that's disappointing. Well, I guess we'll go in. In the blue... The blue fire, then. 
Oh, I guess it's because we never finished um, Olympus Coliseum. So I guess that's why we can't, because we didn't seal its keyhole. So I'm assuming that's why, because I'm because it says in the in the walkthrough thing that you only need to do um, you don't actually have to do any of them except for like Atlantica if you skipped Atlantica. So I'm assuming because we didn't finish Olympus Coliseum is why we have to do it. But that's fine. Uh, I'm assuming it's not going to be too much of a hassle. Hello. Oh, look at how much gravity absolutely annihilates you. If only I used gravity more. Maybe I should have gravity set instead of, um... That's... Oh, there's more enemies. I thought we were done. But maybe it'd be a good idea to have gravity set instead of thunder when we get so little use out of thunder as is. I think that would actually be probably a, a, a better suggestion. Okay, that's fine. Where... Oh, let's arrow again. Hello. There are so many of you. Hi. I'd love to use Ragnarok at some point. Um, I want to save it, though. I want to save it for something, like, pretty big. Not for, like, random Dragon Man here. Who kind of looks like me, if we're being honest. Okay, there is... Where's the other one? Oh, there's a couple things hanging out. Okay. And then there's this thing, which shouldn't take... Yeah, there we go. Should? Nope. This... Oh my god, there's more of them. Hello. I mean, that's fine, because they're not too bad. Um, I mean, this thing we can just gravity. Okay, we'll heal up. And then we'll come over to Defender and just take him out, shall we? Take him out, shout. There we go. Okay. <laughs> right, and you're almost done. Okay, as are you. I will say that this does have a sense of epicness to it that I think um, Hollow Bastion is very much missing. As much as Hollow Bastion is boss fight after boss fight, um, of like obviously these big characters we've been building up to this entire time, I do think the world's the end of the world has a far bigger sense of grandeur to it. And um, just from, I guess little like you know, like obviously the music is is intense as hell, and so it attributes quite a lot to it. But um, I really like. You know, it's it's the colours, it's it's the sense of big enemies. It adds a lot. Yeah, we're gonna swap this with gravity, because I think gravity is a bit better. Okay. Cool. So that should be us done, shouldn't it? In here? How do we get out? Do we mayhaps go through this door? Or a door, mayhaps? No. Through this door. Oh, yeah, there we go. Genius. First try. Okay. Then blue. Because this one's back to being purple, so I'm assuming, yeah, we can just skip by. Hoping the rest we can just, uh, you know. But there you go. That's an example of, I guess, what the world terminus is. Is all these lead to different worlds. You know, you got to seal the keyhole and whatnot. Okay. Right, this takes us here. Okay. Okay. And there's a green one. I'm assuming this one is... I haven't been counting. And then, do you see the fire? The fire's a boss fight. Fire... Ooh, we can open this, though. Hello. So this is the... Winnie the Pooh section. Which... You know, you already know that I'm all about. I would have loved to cover the Winnie the Pooh section. If I didn't actually hate the Winnie the Pooh section. <laughs> Winnie the Pooh is my favourite Disney IP. Um, Aladdin's my favorite Disney movie, but there is something very special to me about Winnie the Pooh is a very, very, very special place in my heart. It's kind of what I was raised on, and so, um, sorry, I'm just safe stating, just be extra safe, because this next boss fight is actually notorious for giving me problems. <laughs> so, here we go, here we go, here we go. Um, I think, so we have reduces fire, we have a lot of stuff raising our defense, and our max HP and our strength. Okay. Right. Um, I'm going to save state one more time. Save state. Let's 
slot zero. Okay. And we're gonna... Wait. Oh, I thought we were doing a boss fight. Pardon, wait. Yeah, okay. We're not doing a boss fight as of yet, then. That's fine. That's fine. I didn't want to do a boss fight anyway. We're just taking these lads on. What's up? God, these guys are bloody intimidating. Okay. Well, I'm a bit um, underwhelmed, if I'm being honest. Where are you? There you are. Come on. Come on. Is it really that hard to let me want to hit you? Bro, there is so much on this screen right now. Like, I know, you know, part of joking about particle effects in a, in a JRPG is, like, a bit of a meme. But, like, my god. <laughs> it is definitely difficult to tell what's going on at times. Okay, right. Um, we should almost be... There we go. Got a bit of a heal up. Um, I mean, we could just have summoned Tinkerbell to make this even easier. But, like, I don't I don't want to summon Tinkerbell every fight. That's just a bit dull. You know, we'll summon Tinkerbell when it's, when it's needed. And it will absolutely be needed later on. But for now, I don't think it's that necessary. Awesome. Is that all of them? That is all of them. Awesome. Okay. Um, well, then, well, I guess we'll then return, uh, okay, um, I will use, uh, Mega Potion now, so that we have HP, just in case, and I'm gonna save state one more time, I know I could go back to the Wii the Pooh world, but, like, it's a hassle. Is this the boss fight? No, it's freaking not. How do I how do I get to the, the freaking boss fight? How do I get to the I know there's a Okay, there we go. What is this? Okay. Oh, there's more of them. Hello boys. Look, I understand you boys are a bit a bit antsy. You know. And trust me, as much as I am to be done with this game, I mean I don't get me wrong, I love this game. But you know. You still sometimes want things to be over with. Okay, right. We should be... Yes. Okay, I'm starting to think that we won't finish the game in this episode when we're, we're not even at the final boss yet. Or at least, you know, the first billion phases of the final boss. Okay, we got another Mega Elixir. That's really cool of them. Thank you. Wait, no, I want to take the Mega Elixir. There we go. Okay, where are we dropping, boys? Where actually are we dropping? <laughs> what? Inside, you will fight some. And return to a weird hole. Uh, well, I guess we'll leave one more time and then hop, you know, see if that by any chance does it. It does! Look, there's a hole there now. Okay, right. This is when we're going to save state. <laughs> Finally. Okay, now. Yes, okay, right. Boss fight. Finally. Wait. Chernobog from Fantasia. Um, yeah, this is this is quite the quite the battle, quite the epic battle. Obviously, Arrow is a necessity. He's going to do some things. What we want to do first of all is land on 
his shoulder high. We hi, I, I want hi, hi. I'm Sora. I want to land on your shoulder. Is that is that okay? Um, Chernobog. I guess we'll just start hitting him. I, I wanted to land on his shoulder because it is the best way to get because we can summon Tinkerbell that way. But um, I guess it's fine. Not okay. Um, well, we do have arrow, and we have defense stuff up the up the wazoo. So, hopefully, this fight can go well. We're doing quite a lot of damage to him, which is always always a good start. Trying to just see if we. Okay, I mean, as much as Tinkerbell would be an absolute aid, just on the bat, um, just you know, so we can actually not have to worry about constantly healing ourselves. Yo, look at the fact that we are so stuck in Saint. Okay, and then we'll arrow. Hi, where are you? There you are. Okay, I mean, we're getting through is. His HP bars, which is fine. It's always good. Hi, where? There you are. It's his. It's the. It's the floating around his head. It's like the way he keeps turning that makes him irritating to hit. And yeah, this attack is obviously not ideal. I mean, it seems to be fine. Okay. We probably could have. I don't know. I feel like we're definitely well equipped for this fight. So. I'm happy. Okay. Yeah. There we go. Fantasia is an awesome movie. Um, I have seen it once. I really, really, probably more than any other Disney film, would like to see it again. Because I don't think I really appreciated it. And I, and like, just to give you, like, perspective, like, I don't think I really appreciate it. And I still really liked it when call it one of my favorite Disney films. And um, the Night on Bold Mountain sequence is insane. And... Honestly, I might just watch that one more time. I think I remember there were bits of Fantasia I just didn't particularly in, like care for, while there were other bits I absolutely loved. Okay, he's doing. He's doing a bit of a homing attack. That's fine. Donald, you literally didn't even do anything. You shouted Sora and then proceeded not to do anything. Thank you for that. Um, okay, right. He is doing some some scary stuff. Okay. What I'm going to do is use a Mega Elixir on everyone. Just so we can get some HP back on people. Okay, he's doing his air thing again. Which should be fine. Uh, he's almost down. He's so close to being down. And both Donald. Donald and Goofy really do love being hit by the big fire pillar attack. It's like their favorite thing to do. Okay, right. We're so close to having taken him down. I'm going to save state right after I take him down, by the way. Just, um... Just because I know this lad. I know... Okay, there we go. There we go. That's what we're talking about. That's absolutely what we're talking about. Oh, get in there. Get in there. Mm, okay, Chernobog, and we got Shared Ability Super Glide. Awesome. Right, let's take a second to, to just really keep in mind what's going on. 
Okay. What do we need? Hmm. Uh. We probably want something that significantly slightly raises. No, I think this is, I think this is good. And um, what we're going to do though is go to our abilities. Obviously shared, we want, we want super glide. Um, but we, we really, really want second chance. So we'll get rid of, let's be real. We have not used guard this entire time. So we can get rid of that and go for second chance. I'm, I'd rather have that if I'm being honest. But okay, right. Uh, save state, save state, save state. Because we're about to take on, arguably, the fi- I think it's the final and then the hardest gauntlet of the entire game. Which is scary, because, needless to say, the gauntlets haven't been too, you know, easy so far. But this is, I think, where I got stuck my first time playing. This was probably the biggest barrier for me, was, um... This exact section, and I'm going to save state one more time. God bless emulation. No, please don't. Like, I, I know I know it's bad. Please please don't hold me. Oh my god. <laughs> right, I will guess I'll save state here just so it's the quickest time save. Okay, right, let's do this. Let's... Bro, I wanted the quickest time save. <laughs> okay. Is this... It. Oh, my heart's pounding. My heart's pounding. Okay, right. Yeah. So, we just beat Chernobyl, but we need to fight Behemoth one more time. Um, yeah, because of course we do. Because why Why the hell wouldn't we? Um, while we're here, what we're going to do is summon Tinkerbell. Because this both saves us MP and also gives us a bit of a summon aid. Okay. Having Tinkerbell is going to be huge. So if you can't tell, I'm nervous because this is where I, this is where I got stuck. And I really, for the love of everything, don't want to get stuck. Okay. Where is he? Where is he? <laughs> well, I know where he is, but it's like, why is, you know, where's his horn for me to, for me to whack with my key? Okay. Um, where- he's- he's getting down in HP. This shouldn't be too bad. Okay, so basically, the way this gauntlet works is if you take a look at over on the wall, which you can see just kind of out in the corner, um, he- there is a emblem part thing, um, and the pieces will fall off as we go. Um, once all the pieces have fallen off, that's when we get to go through. But any time before that, Heartless will keep spawning. The strongest Heartless in the game. There will be a lot of them. Needless to say, this isn't easy. <laughs> okay, right. Obviously, we have a few things in our favor. We have uh, Second Chance. We have Tinkerbell. We have, um, a we have Arrow. Okay. That should probably do it. Yeah, okay. Right. That's Behemoth down. Um, but now, we don't really have a second to breathe because lots and lots and lots of Heartless are going to start spawning. I should make sure, I'm not entirely sure if we just lost Tinkerbell or not. Um, so I should, I think we just lost Tinkerbell. So we want to, why can't we summon Tinkerbell? What? Why can't we summon Tinkerbell? I'm sorry. Okay. Um, so we can't apparently summon Tinkerbell. That's not good. I don't know if I screwed it up accidentally, um, but whatever is the case, that's really not great. Okay, let's just take down these guys. Luckily, there's enough guys to where we should be able to hopefully get HP orbs to, to help out. I just need to keep an eye on... Nope. Arrow. Okay. Okay. Right, I again, this is, might be one of those times where I just... This entire episode is probably just going to be me concentrating incredibly like hard make sure that we don't lose suddenly. Okay. Heal. 
Oh my god. Y'all, calm the hell down. Okay, right. There is... As you can see, there is a hell of a lot going on right now on screen. Okay, right. Okay. Okay. Oh, I should... I need to make sure I'm healed. Okay. Right. If I'm not healed, I know that's what's going to do it for me. God, there's so freaking many of these guys. And they have just so much HP. Okay. Um, how's your guys' day going? Obviously, I have a trim. Um, wait. Which is important because... Um, I'm dyeing my hair blue. Because I'm full of bad ideas. It's not just on the YouTube channel. Okay, if you can see, like, there are bits falling off. Um, hello. Do you want to go... Do you want to go down? Do you? Bro, where, where the hell are you? Where are you? There you are. Okay, here's a bunch of other ones as well. Uh, so I'm dying my hair blue. I previously have actually dyed my hair once. And it was, it was a t an attempt to dye it blue, but I didn't bleach it because I was a bit of a pussy cat. Um, I was very scared to dye it. Um, and so... Wait, there you are. Okay. Um, and so it, it, it didn't really dye. It, like, was kind of half there, so it was just a bit darker than usual. Um, well, sorry, darker. If anything, it was... I don't know, it was, yeah, it was darker than usual. It was, um, kind of grayish, annoyingly. Like, I just looked like an old man. <laughs> but this time, we're trying to go fully out. So we're bleaching it, um, as well as dyeing it. Because at the end of the day, when you're in national lockdown, there are a few things to do more than, um, really making some bad life decisions. And if there was an Olympics of making bad life decisions, well, you all already know I would do pretty well. Oh my god. This is nerve-wracking to a, to a T. Okay. Right. Um, I did not even realize how low HP we were on. How's the uh, heart? Okay, the heart's going on pretty well. Which is good. Okay, and obviously we've got these big boys back. Um, okay, I need to pay more attention. As much as I love talking about random stuff, trust me, I do. I also do need to be anxious for the fact that, um, we are in, we are, you know, at the end of the game. And <laughs> these Heartless do not mess about. I, this, this for me is my, um, probably what I would call the hardest part of the game, just straight up. Like, bro, look at what's going on. Okay. That's dead. You're almost dead. Bro, I'm sorry. Oh, and listen to the music. If this music doesn't scream, this is it, y'all. Clench your butt. I don't know what does. Um, okay. Oh, God. Okay, thank you, Donald. Thank you. I was going to quickly pop out and then... Um, how are we doing? We're so close. We're so close. Okay. Look at how fast we glide, though. Can we just take a moment to, to, like, you know, to really... Like, we glide so fast now. We have super glide. It's amazing. Okay. Bro, the button reactions of trying to hit... Arrow and heal at the same time. <laughs> okay. Donald and Goofy are putting up a good service though. Let's let's respect the fact that they're both still alive. For them, this is this is a feat of great marvels. I'm gonna arrow just to be safe. 
Okay, and then we can fly over and start trying to beat the ever-living snot out of these lads. Oh my god, is this, is this... Oh, we're so close. We're so close. Okay. Right, we're not quite there yet. But we're almost there. Okay. Hi there. Okay, um, we can come over here, start trying to hit you. Hello, Dark Ball. Okay, goodbye, Dark Ball. I don't know what these, um, I think the sword guys are called Airborns, and I think these guys are called Angel's Wings, maybe, is my guess. I do like how they made insanely, how, like, intimidating these Heartless actually are. Okay. Right. Like, I mean, these Heartless are insanely into- <laughs> I really love the airborne designs, and I think the Dark Balls are a really good, um, I guess, successor to Shadows. You can just hear noises. Um, to Shadows, I think they- they, they kind of are, aren't they? If, they, if like, the airborne are the successors to the Soldiers, these are the- um, the Angel's Wings are the successors to the things that are the things. The, um, the magic people. You know, like, the small magic guys? You know what I'm talking about. Um, then, I guess... Hi there. Um, then I guess the airborns are the successors, like, the soldiers. In which case, I think they do a really good job of that. And I, I really, I, I like, I like the way that that kind of works. Um, it's a shame there's no, I guess the defenders are the successors to the large bodies. Okay. Oh my god, it's not, that's not it. That's not it. Okay. Uh, I'm, this should almost, this, this has to almost be it. Okay. We basically knock this guy out with a gravity. With a well-timed gravity. So if we can do the same on... No, we didn't. <laughs> Actually, no, 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 we did, we did. Oh, maybe that was Donald. I don't know, I wasn't entirely paying attention. Uh. Oh my god, we could have easily died then. Okay, sorry, um, yes, puppies. What were we saying about, we, we weren't talking about puppies. No, not at all. Why am I on about puppies? Um, okay. Well, I said it's just like, you know, it's to bring the conversation back. Because, oh god. My back is arched. <laughs> this is going to give me really good posture. Or maybe just break my back. One of the two. This has to be the last guy, right? No, well, these, these two be the last two. Please. Please, the love of God, say that you're you're it. And um, this guy just completely like guard through that, that gravity. Oh my God, there's more. There's so much more. There's so much more. <laughs> there's so much more. Okay. Oh, I didn't. I didn't. I meant to cure. Okay. Right. Um, I would have liked to cure a bit more there, but that's fine. We can make up for that. Look at the freaking chaos going on around us. Okay. Right. Um... How close are we? Okay, right. Hello? Do you just wanna... Please fall. Have mercy on me. Have mercy. I just wanna get rid of them, of these, this, the airborns. I just wanna get rid of him. Okay. Where is... 
Oh, we might as well just start gangbanging these people. That's not what I meant to say. That's not what meant to came out, come out. Okay. Um, where is the airborne? Hi there. Okay, I guess we'll just start banging. Yeah. Okay. I feel out of breath. <laughs> That's how bloody intense this is. Okay. Okay. Right. Okay. Right. Hi. 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 Um, okay. And this this, this got to be like the last little bundle. I've been saying that for like the last like, you know, five minutes. <laughs> but okay. Right. Okay, maybe these guys are just immune to all magic. That would, I guess, make some sort of sense. Okay. Um, and I, I swear, I know the last five minutes have just been me repeating, okay. I really want a puppy. There we go. Um, I would love a puppy. I would love... If you guys have ever seen Prince Got Talent, or if you, have, if you have access to Google, if you look up... Um, Trip Hazard. Prince Got Talent. That's the exact kind of puppy I want. I'd love that puppy. Right now I have a cat. The cat hates 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 God. My hands are free. My hands are free. My hands are free. Okay. Let's go through. Let's go through. To what I think is the last save point in the game. I'm also gonna save state just to be doubly sure that I never have to do that again. And I really hope this recording is working. <laughs> this leads to... The last... Place. So that if we have a defense up that we can use on Sora to power up our defense. Is there anything else that we can start exchanging? Nope. What level are we? We're level, oh, we're level 50. That's cool. Donald has a lot of... We might as well equip some stuff to Donald. I guess Donald could use second wind. Um, I guess giving MP rage to Donald would be good. Might as well equip all those abilities. Second chance, second wind. Might as well. Okay. Uh, let's just save then. If we're doing all that. So, I've been thinking during this episode... We're 50 minutes in, and we are about to take on the final boss of Kingdom Hearts. Do I want to end it now, start a new episode, the next one, to make that just the final boss? Or do I want to keep going and make this a long... I think I want to make this an extravaganza episode. I think that's what I want. There's a lot of boss fights about to happen. Hmm, okay. Oh, I'm so scared. I'm so s We're going to go through, and we're going to take on the final set of Kingdom Hearts of bosses. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, um, so the way I'm going to work this is, this is that I will save state between each boss. Um, where are we going? I guess, yeah, over here, I guess makes sense. Okay, so I'll save state between each, because there are a variety of bosses here. Basically, just the same guy, but it's a bunch of different stuff. So I'm going to save state between each one. Um, if I lose one fight, I will do what I always do. And I will stop the video, or cut the video to when I beat that fight. Then, 
Yeah, so we'll keep going until the end, probably. <laughs> okay. But this video, this might not all be recorded in one day, by the way. If it gets to... I have stuff I need to do today. <laughs> and if it does get to a point where um, it's a bit too out of my control, there might be a chance this video might be recorded over two separate days. But this video will contain the ending of Kingdom Hearts. I promise. Super glide over to, to our boy. Just gonna save state one more time. But yeah, we're also back in Destiny Islands. I didn't comment on that. How cool that is. This island is a prison. Surrounded by water. And so this boy sought out to escape from his prison. He sought a way to cross over into other worlds. I'm scared. I'm really scared. I'm really scared. <laughs> I'm so scared. Don't bother. Your voice can no longer reach him where he is. His heart belongs again to darkness. All worlds. It's like Shakespeare. And all so end. The heart is no different. Darkness yeah. starts within it. It grows, consumes it. Yeah. Such is its nature. Absolutely. In the end, every heart returns to the darkness whence it came. I don't like my short. Like, just generally, I just don't like a short, but I, I don't know. Darkness is the heart's true essence. That's not true. The heart may be weak, and sometimes it may even give in. But I've learned that deep down there's a light that never goes out. Okay. Right, there's a solid chance we might have to cut between every one of these fights because it's real. I'm not going to win all of these first try, but we can see what happens. Let's see what happens. Every light must fade. Every heart return to darkness. Okay, so the first boss fight is against um, and Sam in this mode. Okay. We just need a... Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is probably his... Easiest mode. I say hesitantly. Um, beach mode. We just need to find a way where we can hit him. Just may Just pay attention to what he says. Okay, and we can arrow, and then we can, okay, cure, we can cure Aga. That's what Kingdom Hearts is really just about at the end of the day. It's dodging attacks. Oh god, we don't, we don't want to get hit by that. We do not want to get hit by submit. Okay, where See this is all fine this is all well and good, but if you could stop doing that, that'd be awesome, mate. Yeah, this guy isn't great at not getting comboed if we're being honest. Look at Goofy still putting up a fight. See that's what I like about Goofy. He's he's, he's <laughs> he doesn't go down easy. I do quite like the massive arena here. I think that, that adds a lot to it. And the fact this is on Destiny Islands is is really cool. Where is he? Okay. He is a bit susceptible to combos. Okay. Oh, we don't want to get hit by that. Let's arrow, and let's... Okay, let's do this. Oh, we should probably cure and be on the safe, safe side. I would have loved if Donald did that, but, you know, I guess... What, what evs? What evs? What the haps? 
Oh, we did we get hit by submit? Oh, that's not good. That's not good at all. We're gonna have to be careful now. And until he because he's gonna keep doing and if we hit okay we're we're out, we're out, we're out. We're out. We can't arrow now. Right. See, okay, that's fine because it just means that he's lost his um his thing. And that sure Goofy is now not in the hottest of positions. But hey, better Goofy than us, I guess. As much as, you know, my bro and whatnot. We're so close. Okay. There we go. Right. Let's form one down. That is Ansem form one down. Okay. See? Not that bad. <laughs> huh. Okay. And now we get Crater Island. Crate Crestony Island? Yeah, let's go with Crestony Island. That's definitely what this is called. Okay, right. Let's take a second. Okay. Um, make sure we're all, we're all good. And let's save. And let's go. Let's keep going. Okay, right. Let's do this. Yep, we have a boss fight back against the first guy, first get fought, um, boss we ever fought, Darkseid, which I think is really cool. I think it's awesome how we're fighting Darkseid again. I know it, you know, it's Darkseid, so it's it's hardly like the coolest thing ever, but I, I do quite like it. Why am I flying when I could just be? Okay. Like you know, it's it's fun. It's fun. <laughs> and look at us getting tech points hitting his head. Where where is he? Where is he? Um okay, there's your there's your hand. Hello. So he's gonna do this attack. Does he still summon Heartless? I don't remember. Yeah he does, he summons shadows. Which is I guess threatening in its own special way. I say we're almost certainly going to lose to him. Um, okay. Right. Let's, um... What's he going to do now? Hi, sh hi, Shadows. Bros. Um, there's a place called... There's a, you know, there's a thing called timing in place. How do I manage to keep clicking, accidentally keep, click Uraga instead of Aero? Like, don't get me wrong. I'll take, you know, being saved with my healing. But at the same time, I would just quite, quite like to click Aero. Okay. Bringing himself down. Down to our level, of course. And we get some tech points for hitting. The main, the main thing we can only get really out of, get out of levels now is, um... The... What's it called? Uh... Is like strength upgrades, I guess. Okay, what's he gonna do? Well, we we've almost got him. Oh come on, mate. There we go. Cool. 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 And let us save state. Cool. 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 Next fight. Handsome two. Handsome two. Which is arguably hardest fight in the end game. And probably won't be helped by the fact that we don't have arrow. Okay. I don't think we can summon um, Tinkerbell either.
Okay. Did we get hit by that? I don't think so. Right. We might go for some mid again. Oh, are you kidding me? I guess we just stole this out. Um. I don't really want to risk getting frozen. It also not seems like doesn't seem like a whole lot of point to. There we go. Okay. Right. Do you want to go for submit? I'd rather know... Yeah, I'd rather know you're going for submit than you go for some other tricky stuff. God damn it. Okay, right. Well, we know we can stall this out, so I guess that's all we need to do. I will say, I like the... Um, What's it called? The, uh... Freaking... Um... Complementary nature of his attacks. Like, he'll do this and then do an attack that... Um... You know, if you stay... If you're staying still, would be devastating. When this... Oh, God. He's gonna go for some mid again. Okay. Maybe it's better than... Because I've been trying to bait out the submit. Maybe it's better just to... Okay. He's doing this attack. So I guess we just dodge roll. Yeah, we got hit by that. That's irritating. Well, let's... Uh, let's make sure we're adequately stalling this out. Okay. Right. That's fine. That's fine. Come on, come on, come on. Turn to him any second now, please. Okay, I think the best way we can avoid this attack is just by dodge rolling in circles. Oh my god. We're getting at him. What the hell? Oh my god. Oh my god. Uh, hello. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? This isn't fun. Nope, nope, nope. Nobody, nope, nope, nope. I understand I shouldn't have gotten hit by submit there, but also still, ouchie, wouchie. This boy's grouchy. Um, okay, okay. Are you, oh my god. <laughs> Okay, right. The annoying thing about this attack is just trying to stall it out. That's the only problem. Because there's not a whole lot else you can do unless you want to just hit him one by one. Potentially getting frozen. Okay. Oh, no, 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 no. No, I do not want to do this without arrow, please, and thank you.
We're doing a really, really, really good job at hitting him. <laughs> oh, did we actually manage to somehow accidentally avoid that? Okay, okay, okay. Come on. Nope. Oh, I was too... Thought I could do it there. Okay. At least we know we can potentially avoid his ultimate if need be. That's fine. Okay. Right. This is... This is such a fight. What I want to do is... Yeah, I mean, I'm fine with getting possessed by him one more time. It's just not an ideal situation, is it? But what it does mean is we just got, we just got back a ton of HP, which is always good. Not a ton of HP, I mean a ton of MP. Yeah, okay. Here we go. He's doing his ultimate again. Which we just have to keep doing this to. Okay, okay. Nope. Ah, it's a bloody cycle. It's a bloody repetitive cycle of doing the same things over and over and over. Because I just can't avoid that freaking initial submit attack. Because I just want to hit him for once. Okay, I need to be. I need to play this a lot carefuler. A lot more careful. A lot carefuler. You know what I mean. Where is he? There he is. Okay. Okay. Yeah, see we... I do wonder if we try to maybe... No, because he does that. And so, okay, that is... Quite irritating. Okay. Yep. What? The reach on this man is insane. <laughs> I know that's the last thing to comment on, but bro, this man's reach. It's ridiculous. Okay. Where he's, he's got one and a half HP bars left. Okay. He's doing this. 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 We don't have any MP. That isn't good. We don't have any MP. That isn't good at all. Okay. Now I'm pretty sure, if I remember correctly. Yep, but we get hit by that. And now we have a whole new host of problems. Okay. Oh my god. Talk about a long fight. Submit. Submit, submit, submit. When are you submitting, mate? Okay, he's doing this, he's doing this. Which is, again, scary as hell when we don't have arrow. Okay. Okay. Bro, you just did two in a row. Okay. Nope. Again, reach is ridiculous. I'm so tired. 
There's still so many fights after this as well. Okay. That's fine. 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 Because this is when we can hit him. Except not because he's doing he's doing some funky stuff. Uh. Because I guess the idea of hitting him is just a bit too um, radical of a concept. Now immediately after, he's going for a submit and he hits it. He actually hits the freaking submit. Okay, right. Oh well. Okay. This fight has lasted for a solid 10 minutes, I bet. And we were doing so well at first as well. Is he going to beckon? Okay, okay. I will happily take this. Oh, he's changing up his strategy. Uh, I say as he goes for another one of his take this is. Oh my god, bro. You know what you are, bro? You're a broken record. You do the same thing over and over and over. Okay. I'm so sorry. This must get really boring after a while. There's a part of me that really wants to cut just to having beat this fight because we're not getting anywhere, you know. I'm not... I'm not making active progress. Speaking of active progress... Okay, but then he's doing this again. Which is fine. If anything, if you, if you just wanted to keep doing this, but just give us some, um, some time to hit him in between, I'd be fine. This is a bit scary, though, because... Oh, we don't have enough MP. Oh, no. Okay. Um, well, we somehow got Arrow. I don't entirely know how. I don't seem to remember casting it, but okay. Look at how much that does, even with an Arrow up. Okay. Right. Um, okay. Look at Sora going. We need, we need to be more in with hitting him straight away. We're stalling. Like, it's there. It's like... Because then he's going to submit again. And this is where shenanigans ensue. Oh, okay. And we just completely avoided him there. Okay, okay. Okay. Right. Doobie, 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 doobie. Okay. Oh my god. Oh my god, that took so long, but we did it. We beat him! We beat him! We beat him!
We did it. We did it. I'm gonna have back problems for the rest of my life. Behold the endless abyss. Within it lies the heart of all worlds. Kingdom hearts. Okay. Look as hard as you are able. You'll not find even the smallest glimmer of light. From those dark depths are all hearts born. Even yours. <gasps> Darkness conquers all worlds! Oh my god. Yeah, he's, he's going very anime here. Very anime. And so begins. Okay. Very anime indeed of him. And we lose to Donald Goofy, which is never fun. Giving up already? Come on, Sora. Oh god. You were stronger than that. Okay. Right. Come on, let's do this. Let's do this. Let's do this. Let's do this. Oh, I'm scared, I'm scared. Okay. He likes his darkness talk. There's not really much to this. As you can see, he just swings around his, um, his sword a lot. We just need a... Oh, we lost. Yeah, that's never good. Okay, this is probably just going to be a bit of a, a bit of a longer fight. I say after having spent a solid half hour on Ansem Two. But you see, that's the thing with this fight is that. Okay. Yeah. Just heal up. And then go for it. Yep, go and hit him. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, and... I wish I could say this was the final fight as well. But you all already know it isn't. <laughs> you all already know there are more phases than just this. This is probably, in my opinion, the most anime Kingdom Hearts fight. Just straight up. Is that like... Because, I mean, look at it. Look at what we're fighting. Look at this. I mean, it gets more anime than this after, like, in this fight. But, I mean, like, I'm talking about that I think that this, this set of Ansem fights are the most anime Kingdom Hearts gets. Which is saying a lot. But it gets very, very anime. Uh, yes. Let's just, uh, let's ignore that. Ignore that. Mad Lad does so much damage with the chat. Weirdly enough, this fight feels a lot less epic than, um... It's weird how that works. But I thought that the Ansem 2 fight feels... Maybe it's the way this fight works and that it's kind of just, like, going forward, hitting him a few times, then retreating. But something about Ansem 2... Maybe, it weirdly, it feels like the music on this one just is a bit weaker. I'm not entirely sure why. I want to go out, reset this, and then heal up. Okay. He is half a health, health bar and a half. I just need to make sure I play this safe and don't try any shenanigans. It's hard to get a good cure off um, with all the lasers. That's definitely a problem here. Okay. Because obviously, you, if you um, are hit while you're curing, you know, it does a number on you. You know, you, you don't, the cure doesn't count, essentially. 
And then even just coming up to him, he has a freaking explosion. Of course he has an explosion attack. Like, everything about him screams, yes, I'm the kind of guy who would have an explosion attack. But, there we go. Okay. And then part one. Well, I guess, well, because his name's technically World of, ha like, Chaos. Yeah, yeah, World of Chaos. Okay. Okay, okay. There is a lot to this. There is a lot to this. <laughs> oh, this is when we get weird. Okay. So we have to go in here. Okay. And so we just have to take down basically all these heartless. Which shouldn't be too... Hopefully not too tricky. Come on. Come on. You all know you don't want to make it through this game. You all know that you want to finish Kingdom Hearts off. Absolutely gone. Utterly gone. Okay. So I guess this is the problem with the final episode. Is that as much as I want to spend it talking about stuff. And like. Is that, you know, I, at the end of the day, it's probably more important to talk about, you know, like, well, to focus on the boss fights so that we can actually get through. Okay. Now we're back outside. Fighting. What are we fighting? What are we fighting? I think we're fighting artilleries, which I'm not entirely sure what they are. Uh. Uh. This is gross. This is really gross. <laughs> okay, well, we can take these things out, I guess. Again, this is just a, this is just a bit gross. There we go. Okay. Look at these things. <laughs> Look at these little things. They're kind of cute in a way, like in a really weird way. This, I mean, this, I mean, someone is someone is like drawn some really weird, sexy fan out of this. You already know. Like, look at it. These like tentacles. I don't want to see that. I don't want to look that stuff up. I'm not going to look that stuff up. And Sam Rule Thirty Four. You all know it's out there. Okay, uh, let's take down these artilleries. Hello. Okay. Get up our defense. Bring back some HP. Okay. Yes. Okay, okay, okay. Almost, almost. Almost. And now just this big one. Okay, right. I'm gonna be honest, I have no idea where I'm going. I'm lost. Okay. Feels like this is where we should, we should be going. Portal of Darkness. Okay. Um, we're joined by Goofy. Get in there, Goofy. What's up, mate? How you been? How you been? Um, right. So this is just another one of those rooms with the waves of Heartless. You know, fighting against... So what happened to Ansem, exactly, that turned him into the world of chaos? Did he just have an epiphany? <laughs> like, is this is this just what happens when it when someone gets a tad closer to, like, God or something? They just become the world of chaos. <laughs> uh, I wonder. There is a lot of stuff going on in here. And I wish I had any idea what any of it was. Let's just... Okay. There we go. Okay. This should... Be fine. It's hard to tell. Okay. Yeah. 
what we probably should have done before the final fight was go and get a ro um, the upgraded version of Arrow. But that was... That's for stupid people. <laughs> we don't need that. Hello, giant shadows. Or you sound, you're either a giant... Yeah, you're just another dark wall. Oh, I thought you were a giant shadow. You look like kind of like a giant shadow. That may have just been you blending in. Goofy really showing why he deserves to be on the team. Um, by being dead. Okay. Who's left? This... Oh, it's just the... It's just another core thing. Okay. Right, there we go. Okay, now we're fighting the head. Do you beat... You'll go outside to fight the head. Okay. Where's the head? Where's the head? Show me to the head. Oh. Oh, I see. Oh, with that... Yeah, that does kind of look like a head, in fairness. Bro, that is a lot of lightning on you, mate. Okay. Let's just, uh, let's just slap you a bit. Oh my god. I swear I just heard Goofy say... Thing is, is that the, the moment gets broken the second Goofy says something. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Uh, yeah, the, we almost died there. That's not good. I should be save stating this entire time, if I'm being honest. I will, I'll save state once we end. I just really don't want to lose. Okay, right. Right, we're almost having beaten the head. Which kind of looks like... I don't want... I'm not going to say it. You, you guys know what it looks like. And I, I could be that guy who says it. I could preserve my dignity as well. And so I, I think I'll be the guy who preserves his dignity here. But it, it totally does look like that. And I could make a joke that look, kind of looks like Goofy's version of that. You know what I mean? <laughs> With, <laughs> which then raises the question of if Goofy's that has teeth too. Um, and that's something that I'm not entirely sure if I want to dive into. But this guy's exploding a lot. More power to you. Explode all, explode all you want. There we go. Right. That is the head. Oh, I didn't actually just quite kill the head. There we go. Well, that's the head done. That's the head done. That's the head. Absolutely done. Now we can go inside the mouth. As you do. Which is my cue to save state. Oh boy, because look who's joining us. It's these lads, the Airborns, back again, once again. But we're also joined by our, our main man, Donald, the Donster, Don Old. So being Don Old, does that like mean he's like a Don of a Mafia gang? Why is this only the first we're finding out about this? What secret deals is Donald doing in the back? This is totally. This is going to be a two-hour episode. I can already tell you that much. Like. There isn't really... I don't really want to cut out the end of the Amsterdam 2 fight because, like, I feel like in its own way it was insanely intense and I'd like to preserve its intensi intensity. But, like, we still have all the ending cutscenes, bro. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna sit here and show you guys all the credits. But, like, bro. Okay. Right. Almost. Almost. I say almost like we're anywhere near... Beating these waves of Heartless. <laughs> okay. Look at look at what's going on on this screen. Look at this screen. I will say that at the very least is visually interesting. I think that the, the blacked out perspective actually adds quite a lot to it. I quite like that. Okay. Right. Um, this is, yeah, this is about as Japanese games as you can get, with all the massive amount of phases, everything, you know, in between. You know, this is, this isn't, we're not even, we're not even fighting Ansem here. 
we're just fighting like Ansem's like you know like it's it's just it's weird it's weird to me that this is this is part of the final boss fight I mean obviously where else in the game would it go I don't know I think I might have like preferred it if it was just a straight up duel obviously this is more epic but I think I would have quite liked a straight up duel okay right now we're taking on the main core. Okay. Main core, main core, main core, main core. Where is the main core? There? Yeah. Look at that thing. It kind of looks like Jack Skellington. <laughs> like the face? You guys know what I mean. Um, well, arrow. Arrow up. And then we're just attacking. Bro, look at this thing. It's throbbing. <laughs> I think that says a lot. Oh, I dislike how this thing moves with every attack. Oh, I'm not a, not a fan of that at all. Okay, right. Here we go. There we go. Okay, the main core is down. The main core is down. Main core is down, which leaves us with the last part of the game. Ah, uh, look at this thing. What the hell is this thing? Okay, but I'm going to save state because this and all of its ungodly horror is this is the final fight what's he doing bro bro do you mind god i can only imagine how much easier this is in final mix and um, when you have access to to a uh, leaf bracer which is the ability where you um, can use cure without get without being interrupted. Like God, imagine how much easier that is <laughs> than this. Okay, he's swing. He's definitely swinging his soul eater sword. Um, or cure, just to be on the safe side. Okay. Okay. Right. Close. We're getting there. We're getting there. Imagine summoning Tinkerbell here. Like, imagine you're in the middle of a death match against genuine horrors. And you, and Tinkerbell just shows up. And she's like, what the hell is going on? What did you bring me to? And you're like, well, I don't really know Tinkerbell. But just, you know, just heal me every so often, please. Okay. Um... Yeah, he's doing one of the explosion. Okay, right. Let's, let's take our time. Let's focus. Um, okay. Right. How are we doing, mate? How are we doing? Oh my god. Could really use any kind of MP. Okay, right, right, right. Away. And um, arrow. Thank you, Donald. Thank you, Donald. Nope. We're so close. We're so close. We're so close. There we go. Okay, we did it. We did it. We did it. Get in there. Good. Oh, oh my god. Oh my god. We did it, y'all. You did. We did it, y'all. We did it! Without any deaths, as well. We be, how how we beat Anzem 2 without any deaths, I have no idea. Which I guess what means we can establish that Riku Anzem is the hardest fight in the game. Followed by Clayton. <laughs> and, um... What, well, Anzem 2? I guess we didn't die to him at all, but... He was still tricky in his own way. Pod Centipede, hardest fight in the game. 
Cave of Wonders, I died to. Um, but I did not die to add them to. Didn't die to any of the bosses I thought I'd die to. Lips and Dragon, I didn't. Giant Ursula, I didn't. Trig Master, I didn't. Shocked. He's enacting his master plan. I know now, without a doubt, Kingdom Hearts is life. Yo. So surely, even if he was to take on, like even if Sora wasn't here, surely he still would have died and lost. So Sora was present because you know, if Kingdom Hearts is light, then he would have just died no matter what. I don't know. Or maybe it's just because he's so weak. Like, the light wouldn't have killed him normally. But it's because he's so weak now. Because of us. That's what I'm going to take it as. Come on. Okay. Yeah, they got to close the door. Come on, boys. <laughs> There's nothing. Oh, it's the Heartless. Oh, they kind of look like mushrooms. Don't give up. Come on, Sora. Together we could do it. Okay. <laughs> Just ignore the fact Riku's there. Yo. Oh my God, there's there's more than one dark side down there. But nah, it's fine. Because... He... Well... Yo! He's here, yeah, boys! <laughs> okay, right, that's the one time that Mickey's voice works. This is really sweet. This is really cool. I like this a lot. Take care of her. I like this a lot. This is really it's weird. My hair doesn't cover up half the face cam now. That's really cool. I like that a lot. I really like that. I like that a lot. It's awesome. Yo, I think the first time I played this game all the way through, the one, only other time before this I played through this game all the way what, through was when I was maybe 14, 13. Now we're here. No, it must have been even longer, oh, longer ago than that. 12, 13. So this is my first time what like playing through the game, I guess, with... New fresh eyes. I think a lot of the moments work. I think a lot of them. I think this, this game gets a lot of crap for its story. I disagree. I've never once particularly disliked the story of Kingdom Hearts. And I still don't. I think that obviously this is arguably the simplest story in the whole game. But I think. I think it works. I think this really works. I, know you will. I think the emotional beats. Okay, that, that, that needle. <laughs> that needle drop was a bit weird. It should have been playing throughout this entire scene, but um, being quiet and then become loud. That's what it should have been. Also, is this video now going to get flagged? Oh, this video is going to get flagged, isn't it? Okay, simple and clean's playing. I'm probably gonna. I'll make a note of that. 
mute, simple, and clean. Because it's probably going to freaking... I'm assuming it's going to copyright. Because I, I couldn't upload the first episode for a long time because... Well, not for a long time, like a solid day. Because it had simple and clean in it. And I forgot to take it out. But simple and clean. Uh, does that mean you have to work? Your father, when we were older, will understand what I meant when I said no. I don't think life is quite that simple when you walk away. <laughs> you won't hear me say. Um, yeah, so unfortunately, there's we kind of end on a bit of a low, I guess, in terms of the music quality. The, the quality of the let's play, but I don't know. I don't want to take the risk. This is a like two hour episode. You know how long this is gonna take the render? It'll take at least 20 minutes. <laughs> but okay. No, I'll take like 40 minutes. It'll take quite a while actually. But um I guess this is where I say my thank yous and sum it up. We beat Kingdom Hearts. I'm very happy. We did it in 22 episodes. Uh I guess that's kind of cheating because the last Four episodes were really really long and I made a decision with that that I wanted to change up the content I make on this channel halfway through not away from let's plays I just want to make more let's plays. I want to make bigger let's plays um, and so this was a really really good introduction to that I think this will be one of my favorite let's plays on this channel for a long time um, if I ended the Pokemon Gold Hardcore Nuzlocke going I didn't I didn't enjoy this this wasn't for me um, I, you know, I, I kind of liked it, but not really. This, I ended going, yes. All of this in my face now. Um, I want more. I, I, would, I can't wait to do Kingdom Hearts 2. I can't wait to do any more game in this kind of format of just sitting here for like an hour, recording, talking about random stuff, playing a game. I'm very, very, very excited to do more of that. Um, and... This game, yeah, I mean, obviously I love Kingdom Hearts, so this was lots of fun. But, um, then this series, <laughs> at the time of recording this, the series didn't perform great. I'm a channel with, I have 31, 32 subscribers right now. Um, I don't mind this channel, this didn't perform great. It, it did bother me at the beginning, it doesn't anymore. Because I went off a, well, it was natural, because I did Pokemon, I did a bunch of Pokemon series. Those did really well, everyone loved those. Uh, you do a Kingdom Hearts, you do something different, pop, it's going to, you know, it's going to decline in views. That's fine. That's fine. I was a bit off put by that at the beginning. I'm not anymore. Now I'm, I'm like, cool. Okay, we got that done. I have long said that I want to do YouTube as a time capsule. Because I don't intend to, I don't want to be, be this big famous YouTuber. Uh, I don't, well, I, said I don't want to build my career off YouTube. I want to be an actor. Um, I don't want to build my career off YouTube. Um, and so, for me, it's more of the time capsule element of being able to look back and go, that was, that was a cool thing that I did. Um, and I'm happy with how this turned out in that regard. This was really fun. This was really fun. And I feel really satisfied now knowing that it's done. I think this is going up using Power of Maths Friday, I think. Um, so, new series starts tomorrow on Saturday. Um... Secret of Mana is that series. I might as well just spoil it right now. Uh, Secret of Mana, if you guys would love to check that out, would mean the world to me if you check that out. It mean the world if you check out any of the series I make, whether it's uh, Kingdom Hearts with my Pokemon stuff with Beetle Binky and El Nato. Anything. If you guys could check that out, it'd be absolutely incredible. But I don't know how much is left of these credits. I don't entirely know. I don't know how long the credits are. So I'm assuming they've got it. Do they have to thank everyone, or is it just going to say the end? Oh. Well, there we go. Talk about perfect timing. Um, well, I might as well just quickly plug myself. Follow me on Twitter at, at TXM Graphics. Um, subscribe to the YouTube channel for more Let's Plays. Um, oh, well, it's going into a long thing now, so... But I, I'm, I'll end it. Um, yes, subscribe for daily-ish Let's Plays. I try and do daily. I try and do two a day. But obviously, that's not always optimal. Um, but make sure you guys subscribe, make sure you hit the like button, um, make sure you comment, uh, what else, subscribe to my film channel where I do weekly film reviews along with other film related content, uh, youtube.com 
it's not youtube.com slash tom spurs but you tom spurs on youtube um and that is everything i think so who pinocchio's a real boy for now this is this is where we'll this is where we'll end it Kingdom Hearts is obviously coming back to the channel. At one point, we will do Chain of Memories, I think. I don't know when, but we will, we will do it. This is really cool. This is really cool. This is a really cool end credit scene. I love this game. I love this game. Um, as much as I think that the combat is... No, I really like the combat in this game. I think a bit too much of it might be sitting around waiting. Um... Especially when you can get caught in a pattern of just sitting around waiting like the Ansem 2 fight. But yeah, th this worked. This worked for me. For now, though, it's goodbye. Make sure you guys stay calm. Keep calm. <laughs> Have fun. Stay clean. And all that jazz. Peace out. And for the last time in Kingdom Hearts 1, cheers.